All right, you're at the Blue Jay game. Yeah. Are you having a good time? Awesome. Okay, so tell us, what, what, what do you like about the Youth Empowerment Program? What about you? Uh, I joined because of um, Alex here. Uh, I had my first seizure after my grandma passed, and I didn't know much about it. And I wanted, um, I wanted to uh, educate my family and where I come from. Like I come from a Sikh family, and they're really like in their mind, they're like not really educated. Like my dad didn't want to talk his family, and I'm like, no, I, no, I can't. And what? Like I feel like. If I'm alone, but coming to the group, it's like feeling like I have someone to talk to, and that will understand what I'm doing. Was there anything that you learned, or something that maybe even surprised you when you started taking part in youth empowerment program? Like when you started to talk to yeah, others? There's different, there's different types of epilepsy. I never knew that. Like the, the epilepsy I have, I never knew it existed. Like I have. Um, photosensitive epilepsy and smoke lights or something can cause it. I didn't know that until I joined the group. And what about you? Like, what do you think about Carly and the first... Oh, God, the, the crowd likes it. What do you think about Carly and like how she runs the Youth Empowerment Program? I think she's really excellent at it. She's real great. She's very warm and welcoming with others. And she keeps us very comfortable. Um, around all of us and she makes sure that uh, we're all like uh, comfortable sharing about ourselves and others. What about you? She understands. I mean like if we can't be there for um, a reason, she'll understand. Uh, like yesterday I had to, I had to hop off early because I had to go to bed early. Well, I tried to go to bed early. But no, she's a, I feel like she's a sister than <laughs> I feel like we know her already. Yeah. Right? That's what it feels like. Best way. What do you think about the experience of going to a, a Jay's Care game, like with the Jay's Care uh, community clubhouse? Like, what do you what do you like about being here with uh, the other clients? And like... I think it's fun because you get to meet new people and share your experiences of other um, gatherings that you've been to that they haven't. Like, for example, last year I went to a Raptors game. We were in a VIP spot like this one, and um, it's great to experience it for Blue Jays game because um, I've never been in a VIP, VIP box at a Blue Jays game. And the crowd's cheering and for you. Great view. <laughs> cool. This is my first time. Um, I've seen a Blue Jays game in high school, but it wasn't like this. It was like lower. And I actually love it, and I'm so glad I'm here. I get to meet these people. What would you tell someone that doesn't know anything about epilepsy? I would like what I told Jess Green, that she didn't know anything about epilepsy, or she didn't know there was a group. I told her, I'm like, you can contact this girl, Carly. She can send you an email on the website that we uh, that you guys have, and you can meet with her and uh, look up a lot of information and join our group. And if you know someone that's younger, you can point them in direction to the younger group that we have. And um, I can give them brochures or tell them what website to go on to or who to call. Yeah, same. Um so my parents they didn't know much information, none of my high school friends knew. So um, I anytime I hang out with my friends, I give them like a first aid if I do have a seizure, because it's my first protocol. Because I'm terrified and they tend to freak out. I always tell them, if you freak out and the person who's having a seizure comes out and freaks out, that's not good. So I always tell them, here's the information you want. This is the group I joined. Here's the website. You want to read it? But you can also always ask the person. It's good to ask questions.